at Q8 Hotel Devo. Mabuhay! I hope you have a wonderful day. I had a few beautiful young ladies. I'm your tour guide, Ate Mochel. Ate Mochel is here. On behalf of Maharlika Travel and Tours, we place you to serve you and give you an exciting part and unforgettable trip on this Davao tour. Oh, but wait, there are more six remaining tour guides who are ready to give you an unforgettable trip. <laughs> But you can call me Miss May Ann or Miss May in short. That I promise your trip will not be boring because you have me. My team has prepared an exclusive itinerary for all of us that for sure you will enjoy. Are you ready to know what it contains? Yes, let's go! The destination are as follow that you can also found in your front pocket of the chair. I'm Queen, your tour guide, who will assure you that your trip is unforgettable in your life because you will learn, have fun, and taste your delicacies. I'm Angelan Madharas, who makes you sure your safety is a must. Please make sure that you are wearing your mask properly and always bring alcohol because your health is the first priority. I'm Danica Gelli that always reminds you, if you have a question, just call me baby. Char, I got you baby. I am C. Skyla, who will always remind you to keep and always check your belongings. And I'm your last tour guide, Elizabeth Trikasi, who will always ensure you that you do not regret choosing the Maharlika Travel and Tours until the end of Rolling Tour. Because you have a qualified tour guide. Of course, let's not forget our coach captain. Say hi, coach captain. Hi. Ako nga pala si Francis. Basta driver. Sweet lover. Kagaya ko. Driver na. Sweet pa. Welcome to the land which is considered as the largest city and the orchid capital of the Philippines with a total land area of 2,444 square kilometers. As we are now approaching the first destination and passing through Pelai Street and Rizal Street, as you can see on your right, in about 4 minutes, we arrive at the Metropolitan Cathedral of San Pedro. side. Also referred to as the San Pedro Cathedral or Davao Cathedral. It is a Roman Catholic Cathedral Church located at Barangay Poblacion District, Davao City. Alam niyo ba, this cathedral is the oldest church and an iconic historical landmark in the center of Davao City. Its original structure was built in 1847. And look at the cathedral's roof is shaped like a boat and they said maybe it is a nod to Noah's Ark. 
We are now passing going to the second destination. In about 6 minutes passing by Calabria Street, CM Recto da Maharclica Highway, and JLM Palm Gill Street. One of the most expensive parks, it is the cleanest and greenest parks in the country and dubbed as the best park in the Philippines. The People's Park is a 4 hectare white cultural theme park featuring a mini forest, man made falls, a dancing fountain at night, fish ponds, children playground, and a giant durian dog. Oh, wait, some better is waiting for us. Alam nyo ba guys, the Durian Dome is one of the highlights of the park. And this Turon, that 8 cell, is have a Durian inside. And langka. Kaya, bili na kayo. Kaya alam nyo na kung bakit nila balik-balikan yung Turon ko. Kasi masarap. Exactly 13 minutes by Elpidio Carino Avenue, Davao City. We are arriving at Museo Davao Bueno, located in corner of A. Pichan and C. M. Recto Streets. This museum showcases the history and cultural heritage of the Davao City. There are four permanent gallery exhibits. You can see in front of you the Indigenous People's Gallery. And if you look to your left side, you can see a collection of miniatures. And if you turn to your right side, you can see the contemporary gallery arts that displays a classic and modern art. Nine minutes past, we are now along ABS-CBN Kimpo Boulevard. You can see on your right corner here, the Debone Collector Museum features animals from around the world, from the depths of the ocean to the world's tallest bird species. Both young and young at heart will enjoy learning about the wonderful animal world around us. In exactly 8 minutes, 2.35 km via 5 Ramon Magsaysay Avenue, Poblacion District, Davao City. We arrived now in Ramon Magsaysay Park. Did you see that monument? It is the one famous place in the Davao City. That's located in Leon Garcia Street adjacent to the historical Santa Ana Pier. And please take note of this, guys. It is the one historical landmark in the city. It's amazing, right? The park was named in honor of former President Ramon Magsaysay, who is dumped as idol of masses, and also a president who was very close to the heart of the Filipino people. So touchful, right? <laughs> Look to your right side. In my left side, you can see the Ramon Magsaysay Monument. It's all about 25 meters high, and it is the highlight of this part. Trivia, guys. Ramon Magsaysay is the third republic president of the Philippines. Before we go to our lunch destination, alam ko namang gutom na gutom na kayo. Let's go first to Puente Spina, Orchid, and Tropical Plants who will give you butterflies to your stomach. In 6 minutes, passing by the Leon Garcia Street, on your left hand, you can see the Orchid's Garden of Puente Spina. It is famous that seedling and plantlets of Wally are hardened the majority of which at the production area of Malagos Farm are nurtured to maturity. Look at these beautiful flowers. Gutom na ba kayo guys? Ako din, gutom na. Kaya tara na, let's take a lunch first in Joanna's Kitchen 
which serve as the best delicacies in this town. Kaya tara na, kakain na! Are you ready? Let's go! In about 5 minutes, Via Cabagio app. Look to your left and you will see the Longhua Temple or the Temple of the Longhua Buddhist. It is one of the biggest temples in the Philippines and probably the biggest in Mindanao. Renowned for its intricate architecture and interiors, this shrine is definitely one of the most visited attractions in Davao City. Oh, there's a vendor. I want you to try this. Ice cream, ice cream, kay John. Ice cream, ice cream, mom, ice cream. Masarap to. Tikman yung ice cream namin dito sa Davao. Hey, come here. Masarap ba yung ice cream? Alam nyo ba ng ice cream na ito? I made from crocodile. This ice cream is also a famous dessert here in the city. Enjoy your ice cream, guys. As we are now passing to your right, the Davao City Diversion Road. As we go to the famous Davao Crocodile Park, it is one of the finest tourist attractions in Davao. Davao Crocodile Park store boasts 1,000 of its self-nurtured crocodiles, as nicely as a wide selection of flora and fauna. It really is a residence on the tamed wildlife posts, which are nourished and given world-class care. Davao Crocodile Park boasts its one-of-a-kind zoo, which houses distinct wildlife, such as crocodiles, birds, snakes, monkeys, and among many others. Look! Ang swerte nyo when you're done time festival! Look to your left side. This festival is called the Kadayawan. It's an annual festival in Davao City. It's Kadayawan being derived from a friendly Davaoan yung reading Madayaw, meaning good, valuable, superior, or beautiful. Hence, the Kadayawan festival in Tagalog means pasasalamat at pagpapahalaga. Sit back and relax because it will be an hour driving before we get to see the Philippine Eagle. Let's first have an entertainment side. What's the difference between a fly and an eagle? Ah, uh, no! An eagle can fly, but a fly cannot eagle. Ang corny mo te! A sick eagle crossed the border without a passport. Ano yon? He is now an ill eagle. Ha 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 ha! Knock knock! Who's there? Eagle! Eagle who? Eagling galing! Eagling galing! Eagling galing ng matura ang taba! Hindi kita natin na kukornihang ito! Dahil we are now here at the Philippine Eagle Center! As we are now in the Philippine Eagle Center, look to your left side, in my right side, it's sad to say guys that this is the last destination on our itinerary, the Philippine Eagle Center. The Philippine Eagle Center is a national captive breeding facilities that is established to conserve the critical endangered of our national bird, the Philippine Eagle 
or in Tagalog, ang pambansang ibon ng Pilipinas ay agila. And this part is well maintained. And the variety of species that will be do a world of goods for this endangered national bird. And if you guys want to buy souvenirs like durian candies, durian fruits, sweet pomelo, and magnets, we are have gift shop inside the Philippine Eagle Park and have a many animals like crocodile, birds, you can see in this center or park. Oh, wait! What a perfect view! An additional attraction! Turn to your right and you will see the Mount Apo. Alam nyo ba that this mountain is the highest mountain that makes the grandfather of all Philippine mountains. And it is 8.9 mile that features beautiful wildflowers and is treated as difficult. The trail is accessible for backpacking and hiking, which is accessible for year round. Ngayon, Alam nyo na. And let's take a picture with this beautiful place. Oh. There is no itinerary left. This will be the end of our rolling tour in Davao. As we bid to say goodbye and leave you to your final destination, which is the Q8 Hotel. For the last time, did you guys enjoy your rolling tour? I hope you learned and enjoyed all the destination that we discovered today. It's our pleasure to serve you. On behalf of our team, I know we are all tired for today, but thank you for cooperating with us. Of course, don't forget to thank our coach, Captain. Thank you, Coach Francis. So we hope that you will serve you in your next tour. And now, I'm your tour guide, Elizabeth Kasin. Ate Majel. Angel Angie Manjares. Again, I'm Queen, now signing off. Thank you for choosing our agency. Bye!